Hey, yeah, welcome back. The Girl Boss Brunch Experience is an empowerment brunch, and it's an empowerment brunch for entrepreneurs or individuals wanting to start a company. And here now to share a little bit more is the founder of Aspire Dreams LLC Publishing House, Ebony Troncoso, and she is here with us, and she's also a children's book author <laughs> and doing a whole lot of stuff, but good to have you. Thank you. Good to be good. back. So, Girls Boss Brunch Experience. Yes. Okay. So the Girl Boss Brunch Experience is designed to aspire other upcoming brand owners, um, designers, anything that they want to do, just come out and get new tips and new tools on how to label themselves as a designer or build an LLC or whatever it is that they want to do. So I have some of like the biggest entrepreneurs of today and my time or my favorites um, to come on and actually tell them how they got to where they were now. That's awesome. Yeah. And so when you want to become an entrepreneur, I guess there's a lot of like, ah, I want that, you know, thought process. Yeah. I want to do something. So what are some of the gaps that you're trying to fill to help people to like get there? Um, people think that it's just like, I got an idea, I got a name and that's it. Right. But it's so much more that goes into it. It's like the LLC, the branding, the getting clients, the coming up with vendors if you want to sell products. Like it's so much bigger than what people think. Mm -hmm. And I feel like that's what I need to bridge the gap today or as far as for the brunch because people don't know how much work it is yeah. or money it may cost too. You got some work to do so yeah you're helping people out with a female boss workshop? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, I'm super excited. It's on March 7th from 12 to 4 at Uptown Bar and Grill in Yonkers. Mm -hmm. um, so I, I don't want to center it around the brunch or the food. It's really going to be for the workshop and the panelists. Um, I'm going to have some giveaways, some raffles, so it'll be really cool. And so as you talk about the panelists and mm -hmm. the conversations, it's about being a boss, right? <laughs> yeah. What do you want people to know there? I need them to know that they're all under 30 years old. Like, they're like my age, like 24, 25, 27. Mm -hmm. um, and they're really doing it. Like, they're really bringing an income for the month, like over thousands of dollars for the month. And so it's like, you look at these people every day, but you don't know what they're really about until you sit down and know their story. Mm -hmm. And then you see the income that they're generating. It's like, we all can do this too. Right. So that's pretty much what I want to showcase there. What was the turning point for you to say, listen, you know, because, you know, you got started early. You said, listen, mm -hmm. I'm going to be this boss early, right? Yeah. So what was, what was the turning point for you? Um, everybody always asks me, and I don't want to give away too much jewels, and I'm like, you know what, just come to the brunch. Let me right. just make a brunch for this, because I feel like I wish I had something like this when I was creating a brand. Mm -hmm. And so I think a lot of people now, like, that's just the thing now, to come up with a black-owned business. So I figure this brunch would be pretty cool for other people, too. And the other thing we talked about was uh, sharing stories of inspiration, right? And so it's important to share these stories yeah. and be inspired. Who are some of the people that inspired you? Um, I don't know, to be honest. I don't have nobody that I was like, oh my God, I'm gonna look at you. It was just like, okay, she's doing that, I can do that too. Or he's doing that, I can do that too. So what I kind of want to bridge together is that like, a lot of people have look at female bosses like, oh, we're in competition, but it's not like that. Like, everybody can eat. Mm -hmm. And so that's what I want to present there too as well. What do you find is the biggest challenges? Um, generating clients or keeping them going. So it's like you may have somebody that come to you or they want to buy books or they want to talk to you about your experiences and then it's like, okay, what's next? Yeah. So you have to constantly keep it going and that's where promoting and marketing and social media comes in heavy to that point. So March the 7th is a very important date. Yes. We want people to come on out yes. and be a part. So yeah. let's get, go over the event. Um, so the event will basically just be, like I said, March 7th. Um, it's a Saturday from 12 to 4. Um, I'm hoping to start on time, but you know how <laughs> color yeah. people are. Um, so I'm hoping to start on time, and it's just going to be a day full of like workshops, panelists, questions, a lot of note-taking, giveaways, food, treats, right. everything. So as you've had the experience of you know being around people, learning and getting from them, what are some of the... I'll say, give me a couple of tips that you found to be some of the biggest, most important tips that you take with you on your day to day. Um, research. Okay. Research is big because you don't want to be like anybody else or get sued for something. Right. Um, research you spend a lot is big. Time research? Yeah, okay. yeah. Um, research is big. Um, social media, knowing who to market to, knowing who will buy your books, um, and then kind of just connecting with people who are like minded, like you are, kind of like in the same path as you, because mm -hmm. everybody can put somebody else on. So that's that's just my whole thing. So. Yeah. That's so we're, we're still in the first quarter of 2020. What are your goals, visions? Um, I'm trying to get an office space for my publishing company. Mm -hmm. um, I'm finishing school here in May with my master's. Um, so just a bunch of things coming up. Yeah. Yeah. So a, lot, a lot to check out. Yeah. So listen, the Girl Boss Brunch Experience, want to let you know that you can get connected to that. Uh, it's taking place on March the 7th from 12 to 4 at the Uptown Bar and Grill. And uh, that's a 623 Broadway in Yonkers. If you want to RSVP, you can visit Eventbrite, I should say, at the Girl Boss Brunch Experience. And you can also follow Ebony on Instagram. 
official Ebony Troncoso underscore. And uh, yeah, you get all the information. You get the final word. What do you want people to know? Come to the brunch. It's going to be fun. But no, definitely come to the brunch if you want to build a brand or promote your stuff. Just come to the brunch. All right. Ebony, yeah. thank you so much for no coming. Problem. Good to see you, you again. You too. All righty then. Listen, listen. Stay with us because when we come back, learning more about a book that's going to actually teach women to value themselves. So stay tuned. We've got that and more here on Open.